Welcome to this short NHS Grampian video which demonstrates how to perform a dry blood spot test on yourself. A dry blood spot test is a simple finger prick test for hepatitis B, hepatitis C and HIV. There is an information leaflet in the kit which will tell you about these viruses. This video explains how to take your own blood sample. The equipment that will be in your testing kit includes two test cards, one is a spare in case you make a mistake, Three lancets. These are the small needles to prick your finger with. You may not require to use all lancets. It's likely you'll only require to use one. These are single use and if you require to prick your finger again, then another lancet is required to be used. A cotton wool ball. A sharps container. A pre-filled testing form. A small bag to put your test card in once you are finished and finally an envelope. Before starting the test, clear a space and wash the table or area you are going to be working at with a clean damp cloth. Cleaning wipes can also be used. Wash your hands using soap and water. Warm water is best as it makes the blood flow better to your fingers and makes the test easier to do. Wet your hands first and then apply soap. Ensure all areas of your hands are washed and this should take around 40 to 60 seconds. Dry your hands thoroughly using a towel. Once you have cleared and cleaned the area you're going to be working in and washed your hands, lay all the equipment out. Get the test card ready so you can see all five circles. Try not to touch the circles. Check the test card has your name and date of birth written on it. If it doesn't, you will need to write this on. Write the date and time you are doing the test at the bottom of the card. Take the cap off the lancet by twisting. Put the lancet on top of your finger. Most people find that the middle finger works best, but any finger can be used. Press the lancet down on your finger until you hear a click. This is the needle pricking your finger. The needle will then go back inside the lancet and can't be used again. Gently massage your finger until you have a large drop of blood hanging. Let the drop of blood fall into the first circle in the card. You can touch the paper gently with a drop of blood. Don't press too hard. Let another drop form and drop into the next circle until all five circles are filled. Ensure that all five dots are filled sufficiently, but if you feel that one requires more blood, you can squeeze your finger for more blood to come to the end. Once you are finished, cover your finger with a piece of cotton wool and put the lancet in a sharps container. Once you are happy that all five dots have been filled sufficiently with blood, check that the blood has soaked through to the back of the card. Ensure that the card is left to dry. Once you are happy with your test card, ensure that you wash your hands again. If you are satisfied that the blood on the card is dry, seal up the test card and place it into the plastic bag. The testing form should also be placed in the bag. Place the sample bag into the envelope ready for collection.